What is the future recovery path for China looks like in terms of in the context of global Asian economy risks we mentioned? Is it does it also apply to China completely as well? Yeah. So I mean, I I think you know China is um, at the at the center of um, of uh, the the Asian recovery. Um, uh, you know, so far uh, uh, China has benefited a lot from being able to uh, you know export and manufacture in areas of its uh, of its comparative advantage. There's been a big uh, payoff from being able to uh, meet. Uh, pandemic-related supplies, whether it's uh, whether it's in the medical sphere or in the home electronics sphere, all of the stuff that uh, we have been using during this uh, period of of uh, lockdown and so forth from working at home, uh, China and uh, other countries in Asia have been able to uh, to export and meet those needs. Um, we've also seen, I think, uh, a commitment by China and some of the other big players. Uh, in the region uh, to try and integrate the Asian region uh, more. So we have those uh, tariff tensions and, and possible technology tensions playing out on the global sphere. But I think Asia's willingness um, to try and deepen uh, integration, including, for example, uh, with, the, with the RCEP, which uniquely brings together uh, three, three get big uh, 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 players with uh, China, Japan, and Korea. Um, uh, that is a very uh, welcome step. And so it shows that um, the desire for integration for uh, deepening trade linkages uh, is something that is important to the, to the Asian region. And, and uh, you know, RCEP is not the, the deepest, most, uh, you, know, in, you know, deepest sort of uh, agreement, trade agreement that uh, one can imagine. You know, it leaves some things off the table. Uh, including, you know, not really dealing with e-commerce and, uh, and investment rules, but nevertheless, it could be, uh, 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 you know, provide some stimulus to Northeast Asia, Southeast Asia trade. Local content rules have been uh, considerably liberalized, and this this could spur investment. Static gains are often seen as being small, but the dynamic gains can often uh, be a, a multiple of those static gains. And so, uh, you know, it is just an example, uh, and, and I think a positive signal for, for China and the region.